Hello everyone, Dr. Margaret here again to share on the books of the Bible to give a brief summary. And so today we're going to be looking at a brief summary of the book of Judges. The book of Judges is stated to be written by the prophet Samuel between 1045 and 1000 BC. It contains 21 chapters and it was written for the children of Israel during that time period. The purpose for writing the book of Judges was to give an account of the battles and victories that occurred during this time period when there was no king in Israel. It reveals how God gave them numerous victories over their enemies despite their habitual disobedience. The book of Judges was written to also stress the importance of remaining loyal to God. This book is a testimony to the faithfulness of God. In 2 Timothy chapter 2, verse 13, it states even, if we are faithless, he will remain faithful. Even if we are faithless, he will remain faithful. Though we may be unfaithful to him, as the Israelites were, God is still faithful to save us and preserve us. And as it states in 1 Thessalonians 5.24, and also to forgive us when we do confess our sins and seek forgiveness, as it states in 1 John 1.9. Also, 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 8 to 9 states that he will keep you strong to the end so that you'll be blameless on the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. God, who has called you into fellowship with his son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, is faithful. The book of Judges reveals how the people had been rebelling even going back to the time of Joshua. This disobedience continued and grew more intense throughout the Judges' rule, the time of the Judges. As stated in Judges chapter 2, verse 16 to 23, repeatedly the children of Israel turned their back on God and embraced the gods and customs of the Canaanites. Israel's history unfolds repetitively with each cycle taking Israel further away from God. And when, does, when that happens, God brought, brings judgment through foreign oppression. He will raise a deliverer or judge and then the people will repent and return to God. He raised judges such as Deborah, who happened to be the first and only female judge in, in Israel, and she was also a prophetess. He raised Jephthah, Othniel, Gideon, and Samson, among others, to deliver his people from their enemies. When the people transgressed against God, the cycle began all over again. The book of Judges revealed that each time a leader was absent to lead them, the children of Israel fell back into the cycle of sin. They always went astray. And so that's it for now for the book of Judges. A very brief summary on that. Um, next time we will continue with the book of Ruth. The book of Ruth. And so until then, take care and God bless.